Hello guys, how are you today? This is Marcus, one more time. If you know me, that's fine. If you don't know me, my name is Marcus, I'm Brazilian, I'm from Sao Paulo and I'm 37 years old. In this video, I would like to talk about mobile phone. Yes. Uh, I had some kind of experience when I was abroad. To be honest, I have a lot of experience when I was abroad. But the, in the first week, I needed to put credits on my mobile phone. When I was living here in Brazil, I used to have a mobile phone from TIM, T-I-M. It's a company here that provides internet service, um, telephone service, and more service like that, you know. And here it works for me. But when I was over there, this company didn't work there and it still don't work over there, I think so. And I needed to buy a chip, a small one to put inside of my mobile phone to have a credit to talk to people from my school, people from um, my apartment and so forth. And I talked with some uh, Brazilians like mine that was living abroad and most of them told me that Leica was okay. And I talked as well to other foreigners, Venezuelan, African people from France and so forth. And a lot of people told me that Leica was really okay, that I could enjoy like because they provide credits to to call to make a call and credits to use the internet 3g you know and i needed this kind of things because i also needed to call my father here in brazil to call my sister and so forth so i went to some grocery it was near my old neighborhood and i was trying to buy a chip and put credits on that but for my surprise, my English wasn't good enough at that time and the cashier, the guy that was and the, the cash in the grocery store, he, I think that he was from Pakistan or perhaps from India or perhaps and from some place in that spot, that region. The guy had a, a good English, I think so, but my English wasn't good enough and the guy actually had a strong accent. The guy speaks English, he was speaking English at that time, but with a really accent that I couldn't understand. And there was one more thing, because the guy was talking faster. I really couldn't understand him. I was speaking as slowly as slow as possible, and the guy was talking as fast as possible. It was impossible to make a communication. But I showed the guy my money, my cash, and the guy understood me. I asked him to have the cheapest one, you know, with uh, five euros on it. It's named Top Up. I was doing a Top Up. Top Up means to put credit on mobile phone. I have here with me my my package my package about my chip and the instruction and i would like to show you just a moment it's here okay leica is the name of the company i will show you leica it's here okay leica and inside of that we had a lot of things you know just open it's opening it. We have a lot of things inside of here. I already opened it and I will show you things that I have here. So I have the instructions here. Five euros, top up. And in the other side, I have the number. Okay. And I have more things here. Like here I have other things with instructions and the place that the, the chip, the Sin, I think that Sin is a better name. A small card was here and I detached it, it put inside of my mobile phone. So I did that and I, I won the challenge to make myself understandable to the guy that was in the cashier, was in the cash and the grocery store. And then I, I went home, the place that was living in Dublin. And I had two options to make the top up. The first one was 
to call to the central and to talk with the attendant over there. And I was a little bit afraid, I was frightened, I was almost scared. And I didn't do that because I discovered the second way. It was easier to do, not harder like the first one. So in the second case, I just needed to type a message to a specific number that was um, in the other part of the card and I did that. Then I received a message just making a confirmation about my credit. So I had five euros at that time and I could enjoy that for one whole month. Just five euros. I could, um, I could call my father here in Brazil, I could call my sister and I could call my friends there in Dublin, I could use my 3G, I could text a lot of people over there and everything was perfect, okay? So, this is enough for today because and five minutes is past and I hope to see you guys, you all in the future, okay? I'm doing hard over here and I hope that after one whole year my English will be better than nowadays, okay? So, I hope to see you in the future, bye bye and have a nice day!